Hello and welcome everyone. In this video, I'm going to do one example on equilibrium of a weighted body. Okay, so Zari Romo and Kalali are simply on example the equilibrium of a weighted body below uh, chapter Raimalatno. So let me read the question uh, Determine the horizontal and vertical components of reaction for the beam load. Neglect the weight of the beam in the calculations. As we can see here, this is the uh, simply support beam. Point A is roller support. It has only one vertical reaction. Point B is pin support. It has one vertical and one horizontal reaction. Okay. Well, uh, at point B, there is 200 Newton downward force. At point D, there is 100 Newton downward force. Here, uh, we have, as we can see here, there is a uh, thickest 100 Newton inclined concentrated force where the uh, degree of inclination is 45 degree, okay? So, um, dimension is given. Let us go to the solution. dimension the solution in need. The first step here is just to draw the free body diagram, okay? So, the free body diagram is the same as the uh, point A line, we have a Y reaction, point B, BY na BX alla. So uh, concentrated 200 Newton downward force alla, ziga demo um, 100 Newton force alla. Ziga uh, 600 inclined force, we have to uh, resolve into the X and Y component, okay? So uh, where the Y component resolves in Arago, 600 sine 45 degree honal where the x direction demo 600 cos 45 honal maratna. Okay, this is the first step. You may just step back free body diagram is a free body diagram. But in terms of the case, for such best chemical mass, can be a support reactions. Best chemical unknown or unknown reaction which in best chemical mass can be a little bit dimension. Best chemical mass can be a little bit. You want to incline the one force column where X and Y component resolve it again. That's the Merkur diagram. And that's how to align it. So let's see. Diagram. It's very clear now. We can apply the principle of uh, equilibrium equation. We can determine a Y, b Y, and b X. Okay. The question is to determine those three unknowns reaction. Okay. Well, the second step, which is the final step here, is just apply equations of equilibrium. Calculate the support reactions, okay? Well, first let me bring here the um, free body diagram. Free body diagram is Uganda in the metite. Well, first let us assume counterclockwise rotation about point B to be positive, okay? Therefore, taking moment about point B, why I'm talking taking moment about point B? If I take moments about point B, simply I can eliminate BY and BX in this calculation, and the only unknown is going to be AY. Okay? But you can also take moment about point A. Okay? But the simplest one to um, eliminate two unknowns at the same time is to take moment about point B. Okay? Built an order. Point B, like moments to do BY and BX, but point B is the well, if we take moment about point B, the first one, 100 Newton downward force. This 100 Newton downward force creates counterclockwise moment with a perpendicular distance of two meter, okay? And metal Newton force downward uh, and around the metal about point B is then, 100 times, okay, 100 times two meter. Next, next, next demo here, 600 sine 45 degree, okay? Yeah, force, about point B, perpendicular distance centrum, 3 meter plus 2 meter, 5 meter. Therefore, 600 sine 45. What did it know? What the? Counter clockwise. So it's positive because our assumption is counter clockwise moment is positive. Okay, 
Let's next 600 cos 45 degree. Well, okay, this distance majamarat iya ke wala alla 0.2 no okay. 0.2 ziga free body diagram la rasichu alla 0.2. Well, this distance is uh, from the top of the beam up to the center of the beam okay is ka center no selezi bezi he center of the beam no center o malet eh moment apply mi dereg bet fix ye tederreg bet ye pinu support malet no selezi bezich distance perpendicular distance wem demo 0.2 vertical distance alech horizontal force selezi man 600 cos 45 degree selezi wedet no rotate mi yarego wede clockwise direction what is that direction mass out of the middle of the direction therefore this equal is to negative 600 cos 45 times 0.2 meter perpendicular distance what's next ay ay what is no rotate me ago ay rotate me ago what clockwise are the what a clockwise center distance 2 plus 3 plus 2 7 meter minus Ay times 7 meter equals to 0. Therefore, simply Ay equals to 319 newton. Okay, what next? Summation of force at y direction must be 0, this beam to be in equilibrium. In this case, we are assuming upward forces as a positive, downward forces as negative. Okay, simply Ay is 390. That is upward minus this 645 degree minus 100 newton minus 200 newton plus by here when we are assuming our uh, unknowns we have to uh, assume them uh, uh, the arrow must be assumed to the positive direction finally again well searching what a negative kamata are we clear okay Therefore, plus by will not and now come again positive will not be so plus by equals to zero. Therefore, by equals to 405 newton. What next? Summation of force at x directions. Okay. Therefore, summation of force along the x must be zero. This beam to be in equilibrium. Okay. Therefore, here uh, this must be positive. Magnetum is the other positive for the right direction, positive no blender. Therefore, 600 cos 45 Newton, this force, 600 cos 45 Newton, plus Bx equals to zero. Therefore, we are in scenario Bx internal, negative 424 Newton. Bx, what is no magnetum? This arrow must be to this direction, okay? So that's in the other again. And Sarah Len Magnetum, thank you very much, but I'm uh, coded at you. Just share this video to others, okay? Thank you.